Here we go. <laughs> what is up, guys? It's me, the Gaming D. Welcome back to another video, guys. We have another unboxing up another pro wrestling crate. This one is for December of 2021. It is the last one of the month. This one actually came in pretty early. It came in maybe a day or two ago. It's the 16th now. It came in maybe the 14th. But I'm surprised that it came in uh, this early. It normally comes in towards the end of the month, but I'm guessing because of Christmas and the new year and this and that. In the last one, we got ourselves a horn swoggle. So we're gonna have to check out and see what we got in this month's now what i like about this month so far just by looking at the box is it's black and white instead of either blue and white or red and white i like it i think it looks cool this is the uh the card staff favorites 2021 at pro wrestling crate menu spoiler the other side of this card contains the con contents of this crate now if you don't know pro wrestling crate they have uh, their normal 30 dollar crate or something i think that's what it's listed under which is this comes with you know collectibles it comes with their own creative things comes with some shirts comes with a uh, an autograph uh, you don't know who but it's an autograph next month's crate here it gives you a little sneak peek on who could possibly be in the crate we got adam cole rick flair bret hart matt cardona johnny gargano tony niece irs plus a special item from a pro wrestling gorilla i don't want to look at this until the end so let's start it off with this first thing that i'm gonna grab brawler balls the lucha bros it's just it's just a ball it's literally Where's my knife? Literally just a ball. Oh, I'm out of focus. It's got like that, uh, it's got this weird, like, material. Like, this weird, like, plastic net you know, that it's wrapped in. Let's take a little closer. Like, they probably didn't intend on someone taking <laughs> this out of its, like, packaging, I guess. But, you know, you got one side here, and then they kind of, like, form into each other. Which is, uh, you know, it's pretty cool. Uh, their brain just chilling up there. I don't know if it's like a stress ball or what. But it's it's a ball. You know, give it to the dog, I guess. Alright, so we got two shirts here. The first shirt. Hey! We got Mr. Kevin Steen. The Steen, what does it say? Steen Wolf? steen wolf that's that's a good shirt man good old kevin steen he actually just signed kevin owens just signed a multi-year deal with the wwe which makes me very happy for the wwe you know there's a lot of releases happening so having that man re-sign and he's a top talent i love it i'm i'm happy that they they secured him out of some of the people like johnny gorgano he's off because of his family he wants to be there for like the first months of his child's birth and you know wants to enjoy life and then obviously other people like adam cole kyle riley i think that's his name both of them they um, it's a whole thing then we got our other shirt here yeah this one i like a lot i like it four faces of Foley. Got Cactus Jack, Dude Love. We got Mick Foley down there at the bottom. And then we got Mankind there in the middle also. Uh, it looks cool. I like how the uh, Mick Foley one, he's wearing the uh, Santa hat. Because <laughs> that's literally who he is, this man. If you've ever seen uh, Holy Foley, he really loves Christmas. Like, loves it like has a whole room year-round christmas themed which you know if you like it you like it i guess grab a pin Ooh, an awesome kong pin it's pretty cool you know her uh when she was karma in wwe it was sad that she was only there for not even like a couple months and then she found out she was pregnant you know, like it was kind of sad. We got another micro brawler. We got a glacier. I don't know who that is. But 
Oh well. Got another one of these. The last few that I've gotten uh, have I'm, been pretty cool. Now we have another like comic book here. Tales from the Road. Nick Gage and Ron Funches. Murder, Death, Kringle. <laughs> So you got themselves their little uh, little story here from uh, Tales of the Road, I guess. But yeah, I it's, man, I I continue to say this every single time. I find it cool how they do. I don't read these. Don't like I'm not interested. I guess. <laughs> in reading them but for people who are like yo let me get some of that like limited stuff because like once you get this you're not getting it again like it's this is strictly for like this month that's what they they do every month all right and we have the final thing here which is the autographed eight by ten so before what i've gotten in these i've gotten hornswoggle i've gotten darby allen and i've gotten the sandman from ecw and uh in a a separate box i i got uh, ricochet and i got uh, adam cole in a wwe crate thing oh there's two all right we're gonna open a one it's a dude <laughs> okay i this isn't one that i was really like like i wanted but uh Oh, you saw it right there. The man himself, EC3. I'd say he's kind of the face of uh, Impact Wrestling. Let's be honest. Since they have became Impact Wrestling, he has been kind of the, the John Cena, as you'd say. He's spent a small time in WWE. Didn't really do much in NXT. They tried to make him seem big, but not so much. But I'm glad to see that he's back in there. Ooh, ooh, I like this one. If this is who I think it is, I'll have to look. I believe it is. I believe this is Mr. Brian Pillman Jr. I like this one. That's, that's really nice. That's like top tier. I like him. He's one of the few guys that's on AWTV that I genuinely uh, enjoy. And it's not even really for, you know, what he does in the ring. It's kind of just like he's a spitting image of his father. And Brian Pillman was, you know, a hell of a guy. He was, he was before my time, but going back and watching Brian the OG, his dad, Brian Pillman, do things with like Steve Austin and just, you know, when he was in the tag team with Steve Austin uh, while they were in WCW, I believe. You know, it's it's really cool. But, dude, I'm happy. I'm happy to get that one. That's cool. EC3, not so much. The dude even had to plug his Instagram or Twitter or whatever on the picture. We're going to read off this Thing that I got here. Uh, so I'm going to tell you the crates. So you get the regular crate, which is $29.95 a month, which is not too bad. You get the cheap heat, $9.95, which I believe is just like one t-shirt. Um, you get the mid card, which is $14.95, which comes with, I think, a couple things and a t-shirt. And then you have the tag team, which is, I think, strictly two t-shirts. Um, so we got the Steen Wolf, Kevin Steen t-shirt. Four Faces of Foley, McFoley t-shirt, Glacier Micro Brawler. Oh, it looks like a guy from like WCW. Nick Gage and Ron Funches. Funches, Jesus. Uh, Headlock Comic Book. Brian Pillman Jr. Autograph, 8x10. I love it. Awesome Kong Label Pin. Lucha Bros. Brawler Ball. And the EC3 Autographed 8 by 10. I like that. I like it a lot, guys. I don't know where I'm going to put both of these, but... Oh, 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 it's a ghost. Man, it's just... <laughs> but this one, man, Brian Pillman Jr. I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, I like, there's literally every single one of these that I've gotten, there's only one person that I just didn't know who, who they were. And, it, and that person is literally still sitting in, in the box in my closet because I, all the other ones, like I've actually put them on the wall. Uh, but that dude, I don't know who you are. You're, you know, 
weird. <laughs> but I'm excited for next month. So just so you know, for January, I'm going to read it again of 2022. Spoiler alert. Next month's crate features Adam Cole, Ric Flair, Bret Hart, Matt Cardona, Johnny Gargano, Tony Nese, IRS, plus a special item from PWG. Crate and lineup subject to change, so it could change, but this is what they're kind of like predicting on uh, what each subscriber to the regular crate has a chance to receive a limited chase colorway, a micro brawler, and a label pin. That's cool uh but yeah it was really cool i liked it a lot uh thank you guys so so much if you guys enjoy these videos please let me know and uh yeah i will see you guys in my next video peace